All right, we're here at a house to look at restoring some metal railing. We're on the back porch. This is the view. Okay, so we're gonna get onto the railing here. I'll look back at this later. See what I need to do. Just getting an idea of footage. That's welded, so that's one piece. That one's broke. That's one solid piece. Which is at least 20 feet. That piece is good. This piece needs cut to make it work in my system. It's already broken. That's dangerous. Really dangerous. We redid this furniture, I don't know, five plus years ago. Okay, that was the upper railing. So we got this piece here. That one's pretty easy. You got that one, it'll fit. <clears throat> that piece there, it will fit. That piece there, it will fit. And that piece there. I'm assuming that I don't know if that deck needs to be included or not. There is railing up there, but that's from the inside access. We're going to take a measurement. Total feet of the railing.
go back and listen to my video after I've measured. I'll know how much I have to do. <clears throat> Five foot, we'll call it six. That's gonna be a squirrely piece anyway. With that curvature in there. I'm gonna call that seven. So five, seven, three, okay. Just ready enough for the tape measure to be honoring. Okay, seven, eight, I'm going to call that one nine feet. The long section on the upper rail is 21 feet. That part was nine. It says it's recording. I don't see the timer running, but hopefully we're getting all this. <clears throat> My legs would get good exercise living here. All right, bottom rail. Should be pretty close to the same as the top. I'm gonna have the same problems getting the measurement. Call it five, two is gonna be seven. <clears throat> Seven. So eight and a half, seven, seven. He called that one nine, two, seven. That's all that I'm gonna measure because that's all that I see.
that be in shape just to live here. <clears throat>